Well, what's up again there, guys? Brian here to do three topics. Again, we're here to give you another episode of my weekly Q&A or answer a series of questions that have been sent to me over the past week. Uh, this episode is going to be relatively short, probably only about three questions. I did get a number of other questions uh, in the comment section of the last video, but they were all relatively simple and quick to answer. So I was able to answer them in the comment section of the last video. So before I start answering these Primary, primary three questions. If you happen to enjoy this video by the end, just, you know, if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe and press the thumbs up button because I really appreciate it. And uh, starting off with the first of uh, three questions, the first question comes from Aaron Whittaker. And you want to know, what do you think Attack on, th wait, how do I think Attack on Titan is going to end with season four? I have no idea, man. I haven't watched Attack on Titan in years. I think I stopped watching it maybe halfway through the second season and just kind of lost interest in it. It got a little bit too confusing and my interest in the characters just kind of fell. And so I haven't read the, I haven't read the mangas. I haven't had really played the games in some time and I haven't watched the series in a very long time. So I have no idea how it's going to end. I don't know what has happened since I think I see the last thing I remember from season two is you found out, I think Aaron and Reiner were getting into a fight in their Titan form. So that's the I think that's the last episode I saw. I don't know what's happened since then. So I I can't say what's going to happen in season four. And chances are I probably won't see it. I, I'm just just not really interested in Attack on Titan anymore. Next question comes from JBat. You want to know? Am I surprised about how super Assassin's Creed video games continue to be? Well, I mean I'm not, you can't really be surprised. I mean. When you have a company that's been around for so long in a franchise that's been running for like almost 15 years, you know, they they know how to make these games and they know how to make them consistent. And their whole objective is just try to make each game feel a little bit different than the last one while also making them feel familiar so you can easily pick them up and start playing. But I don't really think that's surprising. That's just how you continue a long-running franchise. And Ubisoft knows how to do that. So, no, it doesn't really surprise me. And the last question of the episode comes from Will Williams, and you want to know, since No Time to Die is going to be Daniel Craig's last James Bond movie, are there any actors you like that think could be a good replacement? I'm not really into the whole who, who this is who I would cast for this role. I'm, I'm, I'm not a casting director, so I have no idea. I did hear rumors a few months ago that Tom Hardy was like the run, was like the front runner, which if that is the case, you know, I think he'd be a good choice, but... Other than him, I, I don't really care who James Bond is, as long as these movies are fun and entertaining. And at the end of the day, that's really all any of us should care about. We shouldn't care about who they're casting. So, you know, that's just my standing on the whole thing. And that about does it for this episode of TPQ. I hope you guys are, have, you know, at least are okay with the three, primary three questions that I got. If you guys have any more questions you'd like me to answer in next week's episode, be sure to send them in the comments down below. And make sure you guys remember it is one question per person. And just to guys give you a little bit of tip, if you want to increase your odds of having the question being answered in the video instead of the comment section, have them be a little bit challenging and not just be simple one sentence, sentence questions. If, it, if that's what it is, then you'll probably hear it in the comments. But if it's something I really have to sit down and think about, it will take a extended answer chances are it will be guaranteed to enter into the video of the next video so like always thank you guys for watching you're awesome and i will see you next week